Hey everyone, this is Mike with Team Endicott, and I'm here with the man Tom Endicott himself. Uh, wanted to give you a breakdown of what the real estate market this past year did compared to the year prior. So on our monthly update videos, I like to uh, give you some stats hitting three data points. So let's start off there. Uh, number of new listings that came onto the market this past year versus the year prior went down 7%. Uh, number of homes that went under contract this past year compared to the year prior went down 5%. And the number of homes that sold this past year compared to the year prior actually went up 1%. Mm -hmm. So Tom, we have number of new listings went down, number of homes under contract went down, but we actually saw a little bit of uptick in the number of homes that sold. Number so yeah. kind of what's your thoughts on that and uh, what does that mean for everyone? I think we experienced that uh, with our home buyers and sellers. We've moved from having massive amounts of offers, whether it's a buyer or a seller, mm -hmm. we don't have that. Now we'll have maybe one or two or three offers. So I think the, the numbers speak what we're feeling in the market. Um, for 2023 for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Um, more, uh, less supply and uh, c going forward though, if those trends continue and if the interest rates go down like we think they are, mm -hmm. which our lenders are telling us they think maybe in the six-ish, maybe yeah, get, high five Maybe cracking the 5% yeah, mark. Maybe five in the spring, summer. Um, that's gonna open up some more buyers. So I think there may be some more um, more buyers out there, which equals demand, and the mm -hmm. supply has been going down. So I think it, 2024 is shaping up to be a competitive year for um, our, our home buyers and a good year for home sellers. Yeah, and when we th when we talk competitiveness, everyone goes back, you know, the the horror stories that we hear during COVID, where there was 35 mm -hmm. offers on uh, on homes. Yeah. Do you see us getting to that I point? I think so. Yeah. I, I think we've leveled off from there. I think the uh, uh, the appreciation rates have kind of leveled off also. So I'm expecting to see, you know, through in the areas that we service, two, three offers when they first, the homes first come out mm -hmm. as, as being maybe a, a more accurate number. Yeah, so I, I would say kind of summarizing 2023, um, the real estate market compared to the year prior, although we did see some decreases, uh, remain relatively uh, steady yeah, from the year far. prior. Right. Um, and we think going into next year, uh, we may even start seeing some upticks uh, throughout the year. Right on. All right. Well, any questions, reach out to us, uh, me, Tom. Uh, look forward to talking to you soon.